Okay, for my next DIY project, we have an electric whisk. And the way that this started is the other night um, we were doing dishes and uh, I was putting the whisk away and I hit it on the, the counter. And I don't know if the camera's gonna pick that up, but it kind of makes a cool noise. So um, so I, I was like, ooh, let me take that to the garage and mess with it. Um, Cause I figured, hey, I could probably make something out of that. And of course my wife was like, no, get your own. Um, which was smart of her, because I would have cut her whisk apart. Anyway, um, so I went to Ikea. This was, uh, I think it was $4.99 at Ikea. Well, this was, this front piece. Um, it's one of their standard whisks. And then it has a cap on the bottom. Uh, it's a metal tube with a cap on the bottom. So I just cut that off, looked inside of it. And of course, all these um, metal pieces terminate right in here. There's like a little ring. Um, and so I thought, you know, all I have to do is probably tape a piezo on this. And put a jack on it but of course you don't have room in this little tube so I was trying to find something and I was looking at pipe reducers and stuff and then um, you know I wasn't really finding what I needed and all of a sudden I found this it's just a little junction box that's all it is it's literally a splice box um, for outdoor um, wiring electrical wiring and uh, it worked perfect it, it has just a little bit it's a little bit too large um, but you can see I put just a little bit of foam tape around the um, the whisk there and it fits perfect. I mean, it does not slide in or out. Um, and then it had this here and a jack wouldn't quite fit, but I dropped that washer in there. And I think it was, I think it's a one inch with a three eighths inch hole, if I remember correctly, but it's a common washer uh, that, that I had laying around and I dropped it in there and perfect. It gave me room to mount the whisk. So inside there's literally just, there is a, Piezo hot glued to the bottom of the um, whisk and then it's soldered to the quarter inch jack and that is pretty much it. It's a very simple project but what happens is when you hit this on something then the piezo pickup picks up the vibrations and uh, translates them into audio and you can uh, can get noise out of this thing. You can get sound effects and things out of this thing. So let's uh, plug it in and see what it sounds like. So it sounds pretty awesome plugged into a guitar amp. What about if we plug it into a modular synthesizer? <laughs> 